I was browsing K-pop X earlier today and I found this insane clip. Get these bitches the fuck away from my fucking man. Get these whores away from my fucking man. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, at least they put the chopped one next time. All right, that's fine, that's fine. I low-key fuck with that, thank you guys. You guys knew what the fuck I would do if you put an Addy or some shit next time. I would have to smack the shot over and him. I think this goes without saying, but this fan is beyond delusional. Spoiler alert, your favorite K-pop idols don't even know you exist. It does hurt to realize this, but you just have to be realistic with yourself. Parasocial relationships can become seriously problematic for some people, and this person is no exception. Talking about idols like this as if you own them and they are yours is why the K-pop stan community has a terrible reputation. I really hope the person in this clip I just showed you is being satire. It seems to me like they are not, unfortunately, because they didn't make it clear from their tone in the clip. It felt ambiguous and I would say maybe if the clip was a little bit shorter, it would have been easier to pass off as satire. Assuming it's not though, this is embarrassing. We need to do better with respecting idols. So thankfully, it seems like the people on X also share the same sentiment with me. This person says you cannot be serious, like this is so goofy, and I agree. Someone even points out the greasy hair, and I wouldn't normally go for someone's looks. I find that a little cringe. Go based off of someone's character if you're going to critique them. This person, I'm cringing so hard. It's such weird behavior. And that's the thing, this is really strange and it just goes to show how crazy parasocial relationships can be between fans and idols. So that's about it though. Peace.